Hey, what is going on guys? It is Lachlan here and welcome back to the Minecraft Pixelmon series. We are right here in the middle of Granite Town to start off. I believe this is episode 4 of the series, so of course, like always, thank you for the amount of support I had on the last episode. Now, I, I feel like I broke records here at this point, but the last episode was just so much fun. Um, also, my face cam set up. I'm actually recording during the day, so the lighting probably looks a lot better. Um, so that's cool. But uh, yeah, the last episode, if you guys haven't seen it, you probably already got the spoiler by looking at my inventory but go back and watch it it was absolutely insane in the membrane uh to recap for those people naughty people who haven't watched it we essentially beat the gym by a like the tiniest bit it was all down to where the marsh tom had the first hit marsh tom came in with the clutch and we took out that boulder badge now we didn't only just get the badge we also got the rock slide tm so i'm probably going to keep that for a while just to make sure on who i want to put it on i'm thinking of putting it on the chop at this stage but uh yeah so there's a couple things i want to do this episode specifically i want to try and train up a little bit try and get a little bit of cash as well you guys may know that we lost a lot of monies trying to uh actually uh do the gym uh, now there was a lot of pokemon when i was just here before and they've all disappeared i think these guys are like literally just chewing them down as they spawn in oh, Oh, here we go, there's some Judas over here. So there's, just, there's a lot more Pokemon now. I don't know if we fixed something or what, but uh, I'm not having like any glitch problems or anything right now. So I'm just like cheering at all. Um, but uh, yeah, so I'm just going to take down a couple Pokemon today. I'm going to do a little bit of training. Um, and I'm going to try and do a couple parkours. Hopefully it should prove to be a awesome episode. I want to check the gym caps for the next gym, obviously, so that I don't, you know, go over the top of them and then just uh, rag that all up. If possible, I would... Oh, there's an Onyx there. Um, if possible, I would like to... Why am I still sitting with Marsh Tom? Oh, right, I'm using the wrong... Uh, oh, okay, level 25, Mud Bomb. We'll get rid of uh, Mud Shop for that one. Um, so, yeah, I want to try and level up Marsh uh, Shop to a Machoke, which does that at 28. Um, now, if I get him up to 28, then that means I can also progress right down to a Machamp. Probably won't do that straight away, but I would like to have it for the next gym. Um, you know, we might as well unlock their full potential when you can as soon as possible, so... I mean, might as well. Uh, you just got to find some uh, person to trade with. Oh, gold nugget. I think they're worth quite a bit. Um, yeah, I got to try and find someone who I can trust to trade. You know, I can't just go around trading anybody. Uh, now, I will have to check one other thing as well. Actually, can I just quickly do something as well? Controls. I'm not used to using the up and down key. I'm used to using this and this. I don't know if it's always been like that before. But, uh, yeah, just what well, actually, no, I got to do it the other way around. So, it would be... Uh, I think I'm getting used to it because of Crazy Craft. Uh, crazy Craft, you have to like, um, so that should do, left should go up, and yeah, yeah. I don't know if it was like that before, but I didn't, I don't ever remember using the up and down keys. I don't know why, just Crazy Craft, because when I look at that side of the, uh, the menu, I think of Crazy Craft when I'm trying to select a morph, you know? Um, so let's go to the next town. You guys haven't seen it, Aqua City. We have, uh, Star Fox there, it's a cool skin. Uh, he's gonna be like a little bit of a tail with his sunflower. So this is like a woods place. I don't really see any Pokemon just yet. I feel like hitting a sun time because I don't like... Yeah, I'm hitting a sun time. If you're getting an Umbreon right now, you're getting an Espeon. Um, I, I don't know. I just, I just like having light. It looks better. Plus, it doesn't look as uh, abstract from the face cam. Oh, there is a wild Hypno. Ooh, we got some high-level Swineups. Um, yeah, so apparently Swineup relearns Ice Shot at 20. Um, oh, I just realized we have to find a... <laughs> okay, interesting. At first, I was going to be like, oh, okay, that's fine. We can get a Mammo Swine. But then I realized that you have to actually have Ancient Power to uh, get that. So I'm just going to bait this out to see if it has Ancient Power. We want to try and catch a new Swine up that has Ancient Power. If we can master that this episode, I will be more than thrilled. Um, we're probably going to hit a critical here because we just did Focus Energy. Um, use Endure. He's probably going to endure the hit. That's perfect. But I, I don't know if I should even try and catch him unless I see 100%. I just use my only Pokeball right now. Um, yeah, I don't want to use my Pokeballs unless I see that they have Ancient Power. This should catch it, by the way, I hope. Um, I'm just like the Swine Up master at this point. I'm just going around catching every Swine Up on the server, and it's just like, boys, you got a Swine Up, bring it to me, because I'm going to catch it. Alright, I catched it. Um, I can replace that. I'll just have like a team of Swine Ups, it'd be great. Uh, I don't think I can take down level 39 Hypno at this point. Um, I don't think I have any... Oh, no, I can use a Mud Attack or Ground Attack on Magnemite. Oh, or does he have Levitate? Uh, I hope he doesn't have Levitate. Um, does he have Levitate? Mud isn't really... Does he have Levitate? Please don't have Levitate. Good, he doesn't. All right. Oh, three Iron Ingots and two Redstone. Damn, boys. Magnemites are a good, solid farm. Um, so, anyway, we're on our way to the next town. I guess we'll just keep going on. If we find some Pokemon inside, just tear him a new one as we will. 
Um, so yeah, Swine Up's going to be swapping them up. I believe it was 27 he relearns Ice Shot, at least someone in the chat was saying. Uh, while God of 43, just walk around you. I think he's glitched anyway as well, because he's got that long health bar. Um, and uh, we have a Hyper Fire here, just chilling about. Probably like an invisible Pokemon right there as well. Um, okay, down we go. That's where Aquarius are to the right of us. What Pokemon's this on the side? We have a Farfetch'd. You'll be pretty good XP. I don't really... Eh. Hmm. And that's the thing, do we keep Pidgeotto? Oh, my face came so bright right now. I apologize if it is a little off-putting, but I just wanted to do it for the Cax. Uh, let me see. Yeah, I can't versus Farfetch. I'm going to take him down with a Water Gun. Um, hopefully it won't be too many Water Guns. He used the Leer. Defense was lowered. Yeah, it'll take quite a lot of uh, Water Guns, because I know ground attacks will not work on him. I really hope the space cam's okay with you guys. If not, I apologize. I don't know how it will work in the resolution I'm going to render it as, um, so apologies. Uh, also, people wondering where Treasure Wars is Season 2. That is hopefully going to start tomorrow. A little bit of a sneak peek for you there. Me and Vic are planning to record the first episode, although it did uh, release today, so uh, that is kind of cool and dandy. I actually think there's a sale on uh, the... Pixelmon set, the Pokeball server this weekend as well for Pixel Points. If you guys want to take advantage of that, do more than welcome. Uh, there we go, Marsh Top gained some XP. Thank you very much. I'm going to poke you because I didn't do today. Um, so, yeah, like I said, I want to focus on using Mar Machop on the way down here. Uh, oh, nice little waterfalls. I've uh, got to give a shout out to the builders, mainly Skywalker, who recreated this map. It is looking absolutely fantastic. Um, yes, I wonder if we can find another boss. We got so lucky, but then unlucky because he dropped bad loot. It was a red boss. Uh, for those of you guys who don't know, the bosses scale, they go green, blue, red, yellow. I haven't seen any other green ones just yet. Um, oh, there's a Marill. Ooh, Marill, a Krabby. Oh, this is so cool seeing all the water Pokemon around the water. Oh, he's got his little caravan he's just put it in the water. That's cute. Uh, let's see what we got over here. Some slow bros, some more slow bros, some bros that are slow. Uh, what else have we got over here? So this is the water town, Aqua City, if you will. I'm um, just checking around for some pokes out and about. I see some tentacles, some golding, some whelmers. This guy's going to carry and catch a whelmer or something. Um, but I really got to get on that uh, that swine up grind. I really do. Let's go into the PC and check if he actually has the moves. Is that a peat skin? It is a peat skin. Um, so there is Lugia. If you remember from before, Lugia was actually... There was a stadium inside of him in the last region. And you could go on like Team Rocket and stuff like that. I don't know if it's still the same. Oh, guys, got a ground on. Oh, my God. You got a ground on. Holy damn. Chill the fudge out, man. Uh, Marill. Oh, that's uh, someone else's gloom. Uh, Kidoki. Mr. Meh Meh. They can't see me, by the way, guys. I'm playing in Vanish right now. I normally like to do that for most of uh, my lights. Oh, a Corefish. I really like a Crawdon. Huh. I'm just trying to think. Aqua City. Water type Pokemon. What have we got to go against it? Absolutely nothing. We have no grass types. And those grass types, if I remember the gym uh, setup, they have a Lapras who has, like, thunder and stuff. So, a grass type would be optimal. We do not have one yet. And that's what we're trying to focus on today's episode. Maybe do some side quests if you can find any in the town. So this is Aqua City. And if you guys remember back in the day, I'm getting a mad rush. Because I didn't actually look at this town when it was built. This is sort of exactly how the first bit of the town went. You had your stadium here, which is exactly the same. This is where you'd go to battle. And there'd be a little stand here. The stand is like exactly the same. I might try and do a battle here like next episode or something against someone like a rival or something. I don't know. Uh, someone has similar Pokemon, and, uh, oh, hey, Kingler. I don't have no, I see, I have no Pokemon to take you down, and you're blocking the exit. I think there's an exit on this side, though, if I remember correctly. Yep. See? Yeah, how you gonna like that one, Kingler? Um, so, yeah, and, uh, if that one's booked, don't worry, there is also a stadium upstairs, and if that one's booked, don't worry, there is also a stadium downstairs. And, uh, yeah, that's pretty much the gist of the Aqua City. And then you got this cool little fountain here. We used to have Magikarps in here, but now there's no Magikarps. I'm kind of sad. Um, but, uh, let's see what else we got around here. We got Krabbies out and about. Um, ooh, wait, what's this over here? That's where we came to. Um, this is Caleb's house. Um, it's not turning on, though. I think it's only bound to him or something. The, 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 the pressure plates are not working. Uh, all these houses, of course, weren't here before. But these are houses for people that donate and stuff like that. As you can see, we have, like, admins and stuff that are cleaned houses and whatnot in certain areas. This is the Pokemon Center. Um, and this is the Pokemart of the town. I don't think the rates increase too much. I gotta try and find the donator shops if I want to try and sell these items I already have. This thing over here, I remember this. This was the, uh, <laughs> this thing right here is a parkour. The water tower. It can be done weekly, medium, no refund on broken keyboards. Like, literally, it is so hard. Warbreaker, I remember this back in the day. I'm gonna give it one attempt, like I do. It's so hard. It, like, I remember this one. This one was just 
it was a it was evil like we used to do races on this back in the day on live streams and no one could do it it takes so long it, it was this water bit right here that used to always enrage me yeah the water bit i didn't like that's why it's the water tower because there's water parkour but like it's the worst water parkour ever and like even though you have oh, okay now i'm just out like i want to do a parkour in this series but i always complain to the admins that the freaking parkour is so goddamn hard um, anyway, let's get some training done and I see magic carps. So magic carps are easy fish I don't think fish sells for that much on the server um, But uh, hey money's money and we need money. He's splashing about what a cheeky one. We got one raw fish from that um, So I guess we might Ooh, shelter Ooh. Mm, Shelter Interesting. All right, let's go visit this the gym anyway to try and see what type of uh, yeah do not fish in this fountain uh, what types we're working with so it's off to the left here I believe this nice built up area oh that's right we had a secondary fountain like this as well yeah and there used to be dugongs in it yeah I remember that um, okay anyway this is the donated warps okay we found that one nice and easy uh, what's over here this is another person's house I believe doesn't have a name yet uh, oh here is social spy users 2000 I don't know someone died <laughs> all right here's the gym over here um so let's have a look at what we're dealing with this time around for the second gym nice little cheeky crabby and the little shrubs uh oh i see pokemon like poking their heads up where are you i see you poking your heads up i thought i saw your poke i thought i did no no i didn't i apologize i did not see a single pokemon poke his head up i apologize what frames are we running right now we're running like 60 frames it's good um okay so the gym the URL, the banned move list. Gym fee is $193. I just bit my tongue. <laughs> Hard and easy parkour. That's the only parkour I can do. All right, so let's see. Banned moves, all status moves. Ooh, I think uh, Pidgeot is going to have fun here with his stand attack. That's why I'm going to keep him, honestly. Uh, no, level cap's 30. Okay, keep that in mind. Please do not use nicknames for the battles, else DQ'd. Please enter the gym leaders. Banned pokes, electric types over level 25. Okay, so it looks like electric pokes are their weakness. If you disconnect during battle, don't heal. Yep, okay, fee will not be refunded. Okay, so that's what we're looking at. $192 we have to try and work up between now and next episode. And we have to try and find ourselves an electric Pokemon. So I wonder where around here we can find... What's over here? Is this like a... What, what is this over here? There's like a, a special bit of... What, what, is, what is this? Oh, this is like another place. Oh, I think this is where they want me. Oh, okay. Yes, I remember because I told them that I always wanted to have a little bit of a stadium for all the battles that I do so you guys can watch me live on the server like I did with the granite one, except I'll unpanish this time because people can actually see me. Um, so, yeah, I'll make sure to do that and, uh, yeah, put a stadium in for every uh, gym subsequent file. But anyways, I'm going to take a cut, try and uh, ask the chat. Ooh, it's cool. What level are you? 49. You're going to wreck my doodle. I will leave you alone. What is this place? What are these stairs? It's like computers and stuff. Alrighty, awesome. Uh, well, yeah, I'm gonna ask the chat, uh, guys. Where can, where can I find electric types? Now, the only one that comes to mind is Electabuzz straight away. Um, oh, there's Flipper. Hey, Flipper. Uh, yeah, electric types. Uh, Electabuzz, sorry, is the only one that comes to mind. Planes. Yeah, planes. Where is planes? Where is the planes? Oh, there was Electra. There was yeah. There was Magnemites. All right, okay, well, I'm getting ahead of myself right now. I just realized that if I want to go in and try and catch the Magnemites, I'm going to need to, uh, yeah, buy oak rather. Oh, there are planes near oak. Yes, I do remember. Um, sorry, I'm just getting too many things at once. And the chat is now rip. Chat is now legit rip. Path to E4 is also a viable option. All right, well, let's go to the Aquapod here. And let's go to the donator shop and sell all these drops that we've amassed since last episode. I'm probably going to have to do some off-screen trainer for sure. Go to First Town, catch a Magnite, then straight fire. All right, they straight fire, they say. All right, looks like that's what we're going to be doing. Um, okay, let's, let's sell some things here. Let's sell our redstone. Only 10 a pop. I'm just, I don't know, 40 a pop. That'll be good. And then gold nuggets. Anything else? A piece of fish. It's 10. What's the most valuable? Obviously, a Dratini. If you see it for a diamond, you're going to get $1,000. Uh, Blaze, 150. Apples, that's Snorlax. Eggs, Executes, Enderpearls, our Cadavers, and Cadavers. <laughs> I would love to catch an Alakazam this series as well. I did that last season, though. Don't want to do the same, like, last, last season. You can only buy Master Balls in the Donut Shops, so they're very expensive. Um, okay, so I think we'll want to go even cheaper. I swear they're not even cheaper. All right, well, whatever. We're going to grab some Pokeballs here. I don't really think I need to go higher than a Pokeball. Man, I'm burning some serious coin. How much we got left? 100. Uh, 
All right, we should buy five more Pokeballs. We really need to make some more money. I want to get a boss and then be able to get some loot I can sell. Like, I, I tried to sell the berry and people were, like, giving me ridiculous offers. And I was like, I can't, like, I can't. No, because they're just going to buy it because they want something from me. They're not going to buy it because it's actually good. Which is, you know, I don't want to don't do it that way because, yeah, it's actually not that good. Um, so, all right, we're going to Granite. We're going to go get some straight fire. Um, and that uh, should hopefully be out and about. Oh, I've got to check that we got to check that swine up as well. If he's got ancient power, that would be Bay, Because uh, I would love to get a Mammo swine in this series, for sure. But if the Poke Gods are going to be like that to me. All right. He's 29 as well. Oh, we'll use him over this. And Pounder Snow Mud Slap. He's got Ice Shot. He's level 29. We'll keep him for now. But I need ancient power. I think there's an ancient power TM. I don't know. Um... Actually, I want to check to see if there is an Ancient Power TM. Because I know before you can only get it from breeding. No, there is not one. I should have checked that in the game room menu to see if it's actually there. Okay, fair enough, fair enough. Um, well, I guess we'll leave... Uh, I'm going to leave Rufflet there for now because I'm not going to use Rufflet next gym. I'm going to have a legit set of six that I'm not going to have any subs. And Rufflet did absolutely nothing last episode apart from let me know what Pokemon was first. Which I guess you could... You could argue that that's useful. It, it, it was somewhat useful, but it wasn't like, oh my god, boys. There we go. Um, all right, so this is where the Magnemite Town's at. All right, there's a Pawniard. Oh, that's it's it's night time. All right, guys. Again, if you're going for a Umbreon, GG. I have the commands and I can use them and I can abuse them. I don't normally want to do this in episodes, but I just hate nighttime. I just hate it. Um, so, anyways, guys, I'm gonna go around look for a bit and hopefully I'll find some Magnemites soon enough. Okay. This will work. I've randomly found a Flappy on top of the mountain. It's electric type, and it's under 25, and Ampharos is kind of a cool Pokemon. I know people actually don't think it's that good, but I used to love Ampharos in my uh, in my second gen series, so I'm going to try and catch one of these. Uh, what's my best attempt at trying to catch one of these? I'll go for a Karate Chop, because I know it won't do too much damage, because uh, fighting doesn't do much on electric. Oh, there's a Dugong on top of the hill. Damn it, man. Uh, Cotton Spore, decreased highly. Let's see what we're going to do for a low kick. Probably not much. There we go. Oh, Paralyzed Machop, because he's got that ability where he paralyzes people. Or is that Cotton Spore? I don't really know. Oh, he's taking me down. He took recoil damage. We've got to watch that. we got to watch that. We do not want to lose Flappy here. Oh, boys. Okay. Uh, we got to watch that, because he'll take recoil soon enough. Uh, can I status affect him? I don't think I can status affect him. Uh, I'll switch over to Pidgeotto, and I'll use Quick Attacks from then on, or I'll just let him take him down. I'll let him take himself down, you know? Just let him uh, take it down. Come on, Flaffy. I really want to catch you. Cotton Spore, please don't do this. Just quick and easy Quick Attack. Shouldn't do too much. Three levels higher. Oh, boys, that's a little close to where I want to go. And he's killing himself. He's Red Bard. Pokeball. Let's do it. Come on, baby. Also, if people are wondering what, what, how I have this little sachet with all my, like, you know, my, my character right there, uh, that is uh, a thing you get for donating to the mod, but they gave it to me because I do a lot for the mod and record things. And they gave me a fancy one in the 1.8 version, which, by the way, a lot of people are asking when Pokeballs were up to 1.8. Holy damn, you just used Thunder Wave on me. Thank God he didn't use Takedown. Um, when we'll go to 1.8 is when there's, like, a sponge or bungee version that goes to 1.8. Trust me, I want to go to 1.8 just as much as you do, but I just, you just can't. We just can't yet. Please, Flappy. Yes, you captured Flappy. All right. Now, I know I want to catch a Magneton, though. I really want to make sure I have electric types to go. Uh, there's this Celio. Ooh. Ooh, Celio. I love Celio. Celio is so cool. Walrin is an absolute dope Pokemon. Um, we have a lot of... Oh, 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 oh. Another Flappy. But he's over 25, so we cannot catch him. And another Flappy. And a Piloswine. And a Marsh Tomp. And another Flaffy. Should we catch more Flaffies? I sort of want to try and catch a Pilot Swine to see if he's got the right, you know, stuff. Um, actually, no, let's just do some training, like we said. Let's do some training. Um, I guess the best one to train would be Marsh Tomp and just use Mud Bomb. That'd be the best one. I mean, yeah, let's get up to 30, see what we can do. I really do want to try and emphasize getting uh, what's his face up to Mud Bomb Mist. That's the accuracy problem there with that one. Maybe shouldn't have got rid of uh, Mudshot. Because Mud Bomb, when it misses, is kind of annoying. We're, pretty much the goal is to get Earthquake on him. But the only Pokemon that can learn Rock Slide, I believe uh, Swampert or Marsh Tomp can. Uh, I believe uh, Machop can. And I believe that's it. So by a lot, I mean not many. <laughs> um, Alright, easy levels. Can Mar Machop take this one out? I feel like he does. Ice Ground. Oh, it's just the ice he gets a super effect on. Wow, I'm becoming God in this little um, face cam screen. <laughs> Uh, okay, it's not doing too much. Hopefully just uses Odo Sleth a lot, or else he'll probably one bang with chop. Uh, come on, I don't want to see the bar. Oh, he's got ancient power. Boys, 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 boys. He's got ancient power. 
He's got ancient power. If we can catch this Pylos one. I knew I should have bought one Great Ball for a reason. All right. Okay. What's really... I'm scared we're going to crit. I'm scared we're going to crit. All righty. Uh, wait. Um, pressure. Pressure. Let's switch to Swine Up. Just to... Just, just to switch it up. Switch it up. All right, Swine Up. Gonna do a little bit of ice on ice. Just because we know... Oh, let's use Mud Slap so we can't hit moves as well. Hopefully it's not super... All right, Accuracy was just crazy. This is the way we can chip at him. It's chip damage. Ice Shard will probably do the same thing, but this way he'll miss his move. It doesn't look like he has any good moves, though. I will say that. Oh, he has Ancient Power. Uh, one more Mud Slap, and then we throw a Pokeball. We could probably go for two. I wish it would show their freaking values on what HP he's got. Mud Slap. All right, one more Mud Slap. One more Mud Slap. One more Mud Slap, and then, then we throw Pokeballs. If we crit it and it kills him, I'll be piddled. All right. All right. We can probably go for one more, but I don't want to risk it. I really want this. Come on. This is for the late game of a Mamo Swine. Come on, please. Please, Pilo Swine. This is going to be huge. Come on, Pilo Swine. You can do it. You know you can. You know you can. We really want to get a Mamo Swine. Come on. There's some guy up in the background right there with an Iron Man mask, and he's like, boys, I'm going, oh, no. Come on. No, 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 no. Come on. Help me, Iron Man. I need your help. Come on. I want to be an Avenger, too. I, I really want a Mamo Swine. Come on. Waiting. Waiting. Come on, I just want to see the little chat option come up. Gray, you captured Pilo Swine. Come on, hasn't broken out yet. You captured. You. You captured Pilo Swine. Yes! Alrighty, boys. Whoa, someone is getting random Pokemon. And they're all random shinies. Someone has a lot of pixel points. Holy damn. Boys, that is insane. Um, alrighty. Well, anyways, we have. Now, we can't use that Pilo Swine for this gym sad face not really though because that is an epic pokemon now all we need to do i think it goes 30 to 35 i'll have to check the, the second gym but i believe it's 35 if it's 40 cap for the um third gym we can use them in the next one um maybe i want to stack flaffies screw it i'm gonna stack flaffies come at me boys like i'm gonna stack flaffies he's a red bar i might as well catch another one please catch i only got one pokeball would be a wasted pokeball but if i have two flaffies uh, and they're both, I max him out probably to 25. Get Machop up a little bit. He's the only one that I'm a little scared of right now. Like, we need to get him up. Like, let's see. Let's, let's still still the Marsh up here. Yeah, let's try and see if there's any other Ice Pokemon. That Celo's still up here. I'll give him another go for his money. Um, oh, it's Mareep's up here. Damn it. Where are the Magnemites at? I feel like the Magnemite typing will be so crucial, though. There's a Seal up here. Oh, perfect. Make him easy bangers. Oh, don't tell me he's glitched. I think my Machop's glitched, if anything. Um... We haven't had this issue in so long. I think it's just a glitched Pokemon, though. Because, like, if I go for Center Marsh Tomp. Yeah, that's a shame. It's a glitch seal. That would have been so fun to verse as well. You piddle me off. Let me just double check it is that. So, let me just, if I go to kill Mareep. Yeah, it was just a seal. Um, I'm going to get paralyzed here because he's got that ability that makes physical ones. Yeah, that's so annoying. I'm a poke heal after this. Come at me, boys. Come at me. I'm on my way. Try and get myself. I'm a high level Machop and uh, there's nothing you can do about it because that's all I really want is a high level Machop and uh, if you want to have a problem about it, you can have a problem about it. Now the thing is, I've got to ask, what happens, I'm just going to run away from this battle because he's missing hits, what happens if I have a Flaffy and they get paralyzed from it, like I can't be held responsible for that, I don't think you can be. Um, <laughs> Before they say you can't have status doing abilities, that would suck. Um, yeah, no, well, that's going to suck for them. I actually don't even know, because I'm not a gym leader. Also, I think we're missing all of our attacks because we're paralyzed. No, we got the low crit critical. Oh, that is a godsend. All right, let me just double check. What is the most powerful hit? Low kick, a powerful kick that makes the foe fall over, inflicts greater damage on heavy targets. That's what I thought. Low sweep. You attack the target's legs with reducing the target's speed stat. Okay. 60 and dependent on, on heavy weight. Uh, karate Chop, yeah, Karate Chop is by far the lowest. Target is attack, critical hits land more easily, okay. Uh, the target is thrown using the power of gravity. It inflicts damage equal to the user's level. Okay, so it would do 22 damage. Yeah, um, I think I'll not learn that one. Um, might be better at high levels, because you do 100 damage. 
uh, if you're level 100, I guess. I, I don't know if it's a one-to-one -one correlation though, so I could be wrong about that one right there. Um, but let's see if we got any other Pokemons to find and hopefully train up on Poke Heal because I just can't be bothered with that paralyzed Machop. Yeah, I want to see if there's any other Pokemons out here that'll just hopefully, ho hopefully, hopefully get our um, Pokemans up. Oh, a Staraptor, you're too. Oh, a Maggie. A Magimite, the ones that have been like straight fire. Oh, it's a little, cr little, little cabin in here. Um, no, I actually can't take down a Maggie just now because I, I'm just going to use um, Marsh Tom. Marsh Tom, take down the Maggie, please. There we go. Oh, there's an Arbok behind me. Ooh, Arbok. Arbok. Um, what could I do to Arbok that would make him settle down? I could... I'll just get Mud Slap for the 100% accuracy. He's got 1 HP. I think it's sturdy or something. Um, oh, easy ironing it. Yeah, make sure I always kill the Maggies when I see him. Um, yeah, I'm wondering with Arbok right here. 39. I wonder if he has... What if I weaken him with Marsh Tom? Um, and then... Yeah, I feel like if I... Because I need some Mud Bombs. Obviously, he's poison. Uh, hopefully, I don't get one bang there. Um, and then Screeched. Good. And a miss. Perfect. Yeah, if we, if we give him a little bit of a mud bomb tack and then switch out to our boy Machop to go in for like a low kick. He's missing all his hits, by the way. He's got one, one more mud bomb and then we switch. It'd be actually kind of cool if we kill Marsh Tom at this point. So then we just get all the XP on our boy. Machop Chops. Oh, Fire Fang. Not very effective, my friend. Um, I'm going to go for a mud slap. Please don't kill him. Eh, if he kills him, whatever. Just to lower his accuracy so he doesn't actually hit Machop. Uh, he's stockpiling. Alrighty, accuracy was decreased. I'm gonna play. I'm gonna go with a play here. Machop, please. Come on, we need you. We need this XP on you. We need to get you up to 28, level 22 right now. I didn't realize you had a level for something. Ah, uh, Screech. Oh, boys, but did it miss? All right, low kick. Eh, it's, I probably should have gone low sweep actually, because uh, Arbok's not that heavy. Kind of heavy, but he's not that heavy. Oh, he's been poisoned, but he did. 27, 23. We're going to start watching our levels this time. I know there is a way to disable our leveling, guys. A lot of people are like, Lachlan, you know you can disable leveling? I'm like, yes, I know I can disable leveling, but I just didn't select it because I'm lazy because then you got to undo it later and then you're just like, oh, no, I forgot to do it. Um, I don't think there's any secrets in here, so I guess we will probably leave the building um, and just jump down in the waterfall and keep jumping down subsequent waterfalls. Oh, it's got ears down here and sea kings. Ooh, hello. Um, what's this? We have a fisherman over here. I mean, what the frick is this? It's like an underground mausoleum. Chefs and waiters. Oh, boys. See, this is the thing I love about a computer. They just build, like, these all these weird things. It's just, like, it's so funny. Like, <laughs> I don't know what to say. This is, look at this beach magic guy, by the way. I'm sorry, buddy, but you're just gonna get killed. Like, I'm sorry. Uh, I probably should have used, like, low sweep. More damage. Damn it. Must be crit. Um, karate chop. Can I chop? Yeah, we go. Three fish. Fish, fish, fish. Boys, I don't know what to say, um, but I, don't, I want to know how to get into this place, this exclusive club of cool kids. How do I get in? It's almost like it's a club with cool kids. A cool kid club, maybe. Um, <laughs> yeah, but, but seriously, though, how do I get in? The entrance looks like it's over here, but it looks like you have to teleport in or something. Um, let me have a look and see if there's a secret entrance via the waterfall. Duns thinks there is entrances. Now I'm climbing down the waterfall just to check. There is no secret entrances, guys. It's a very exclusive club. Alrighty. Oh, didn't kill myself. That's hype. Uh, magic cup, magic cup. I probably could. This guy's gonna drown or something. Yeah, I probably could see myself just. Uh, oh, cool fish. I wonder if you drop much. Um, I mean, might as well just check, see what they drop. I mean, I, a lot of the new gen Pokemon, I don't really know what they drop. And uh, I'd like to find out. And this one drops nothing but a little bit of XP. Hello, Barker. How are you today? Oh, damn. You can't jump in there. I was like, damn, I get back in the map. But uh, anyways, guys, I'm barely covering 30 FPS. I apologize if some of this has been under 60 FPS. It's, uh, it's not me, it's the mod. I, it's not me, it's the mod. Oh, imagine if I just saw a shiny magic cup just in here and I just pounced on it. But uh, anyways, guys, I think that'll do for today's episode of Pixelmon. If you guys did enjoy, be sure to leave a like rating below. It's awesome to have your support on the series. And uh, yeah, we'll probably do a little bit of off-screen training. Potentially, maybe even a water gym next episode. We'll have to see. Uh, but very successful episode, to say the least. And uh, yeah, if you guys want to show your support with like rating, more than appreciate it. And uh, yeah, have a great weekend, guys. See you guys next time. Later, guys.